Intel Performance Maximizer is a one-click overclocking tool for Intel 9th Gen processors and Core X series processors. My name is Fraser and I'm from Memwave and today we're going to show you an installation guide for the Intel Performance Maximizer. In order to install the Intel Performance Maximizer software, you will need a PC with a Z390 chipset motherboard with the latest BIOS update installed, running on Windows 10 with at least 8 gigs of RAM and 16 gigs of available free storage, and a compatible CPU which includes select 9th gen and X series Intel processors as shown on the screen. Before beginning installation, it is best to set your motherboard's BIOS settings to default. It is also best to disable or uninstall any other overclocking tools, such as the auto overclocking features in the BIOS. Now that we're back in Windows, we want to download the Intel Performance Maximizer from Intel's official website. You can check the description below on this video for a link. Once you get to this screen, you have to pick either 9th generation or Core X series. Once it finishes downloading, right click it and extract the files. So now that the files are extracted, you want to double click on the ex executable Intel Performance Maximizer. It's going to open up with a license agreement, click I accept and then click install and then it will ask you to click yes to allow the app to make changes. Once it's finished, it will ask you to restart your computer. So once Windows starts again, you want to click on the Intel Performance Maximizer on your desktop. Make sure that after you click continue that you carefully read the important disclaimer. And then before you continue, if you have any concerns about the safety of using this software, or perhaps you're scared of bricking your hardware, there's actually this convenient plan that Intel offers. It's called the Intel Performance Tuning Protection Plan and it basically offers you peace of mind by selling you this protection plan. If we wanted to protect our 9900KF, we could pay $20 and then if something bad happened with the software, we would get a new one. Proceed by selecting an internal storage device to create the UEFI partition. In this case, we select C which is our SSD. Now once it's finished, it will tell you it's ready. So once you're happy to go, click Run Tests and then Yes, and it will reboot your system. If you change your mind, you can safely cancel the process by pressing any key within the first 10 seconds of testing. During testing, Intel will report its progress to you. The test will involve a series of reboots and take a few hours to complete. If during testing any error messages appear, check the troubleshooting section of the Intel Performance Maximizer user guide for help. Or alternatively, check out the troubleshooting link below. Once Intel has completed all of its tests, it will automatically boot you back into Windows, at which point the Performance Maximizer will ask you to click continue to view your test results. And that's it. Thanks for watching our video on installing the Intel Performance Maximizer. If you'd like any additional information or help, please check out the links in our description below.